Malima. <laughs> so we're at the Home Depot getting Lowe's. This is Lowe's. They're all the same. They're technically really not the same. But yeah, we're at the Home Depot getting supplies for we're at Lowe's. We're at, and I got on blue. We're at Lowe's getting supplies for Grandma's chicken coop. Uh, Grandma has two chickens and no coop. So we are going to build a coop. Alima's <laughs> face is always hilarious. So I just purchased all of this wood to build Grandma's chicken coop with all of the hardware. I mean, it was going to be a 4x4 four four, which is good for maybe up to six chickens, but she only has two chickens, and it was $360. Now I can buy a chicken coop with all the pieces already cut out and just assemble it for like 280 So I think that we're about to take this stuff back. Do you want to know why I look like this, guys? Because I'm telling her it's hard for me to breathe right now. And then she's just filming. Why's that hard for you to breathe? Because I'm out here. Outside in the in the air? Yeah. Okay. Anyway, yeah, we're about to return this stuff to Lowe's and um order. Why did you stay home this time? Because I know where I'm at now. We're about to go ahead and take all this stuff right back on inside. I didn't know it was gonna be three hundred and six three hundred and sixty dollars and I can just I mean she literally only has two two chickens. So I mean yeah, whatever. It's going back. Okay, so I'm even thinking about it even more. Rather than me still spend another $280 on a chicken coop, I'm going to try and see what I can do with all of the wood that's there. That's what I said that I was going to initially do anyway. So since she has a whole bunch of pilot wood and everything, we're going to see. It's, it's extra work. I was trying to get out of like doing extra work. But we're going to see what we can build with what's on the property. Recycle? No, reduce, reuse, recycle. Reduce, reuse. <laughs> reduce, reuse, recycle. Which is for the price of wood? Yeah, you're going to look. With the tiny home, everything like, bro, I need. Where is the used wood? Where is the reclaim? Because wood right now is like, what are you even talking about? $65 for a sheet of plywood. What are you playing at, Pata? What are you playing at? What are you playing at? This is a real <laughs> this is a real life chicken egg that came from my mother's chicken. And we can prove it. They don't need to see the chickens until the chickens are in the coop. Yeah. <laughs> but um it kind of freaks me out because it's warm. I didn't feel it like yet. Oh, it kind of, it, it freaks me out. Does it feel like a, um, a hard boiled egg? No, it feels like a live egg. Like, Can I feel it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, it is warm. It's warm. It's so freaky. Oh. It's so is strange. Is there greenness on it? No. Oh. It's very, very, very strange, but it's an egg. It's a real life chicken egg. A little small little baby egg. All right. So... I want to show you guys the situation that we have going on here so this is the this was an old dog you know kennel or whatever so we're going to use that as the chicken run not the coop that's the base of the coop right there but the problem is this gate it doesn't actually lock there's a, a gap so what i'm attempting to do is i'm going to attach this two by four from here through this center to this through the gap I'm gonna move I'm gonna move this probably put it um you know we'll, we'll, we're gonna figure it all out yeah but just want to show you guys the situation Clasp it. Mm, what is the easiest way to get over there? 
but also like you know fresh enough this seems like a pretty good tree too oh jesus that's a loss tree and we're gonna cut it and see if we can use it as a pole in between there let's see I said I had to cut this so it can actually slide down on it and um, I mean it's you know like it's what's funny okay so like it doesn't open or anything right it doesn't open but it's not as if so yeah, what I am gonna get uh, some more brackets. I'm gonna probably get some more of these. Maybe two more of these, just so it's uh, sturdier, obviously, because this isn't sturdy. But um, yeah. Okay, so yeah, still haven't tightened that up, but all right, so we got to get the the netting up here, the chicken wire up at the top. Had to cut another tree down. This is actually from the first tree because it was sagging down. So I'm about to cut some more up that tree right there and put that up there. So getting the netting up and Cutting this down and getting things done. Getting done.
not this. Problem building with um, palettes is the fact that uh, you have to break the palettes down. Totally prolongs your whole process. I know you guys know. Happy chicken coop building. So yeah, I look again at the first project I ever did you know, uh, construction building wise. And that's Zeus's, you know, dog run. And he can, the reason why there's pallets at various points is because he doesn't want to be in there apparently. And um, he keeps breaking out. So yeah, definitely never, I would not use chicken wire for a dog run. I mean, hey, hindsight, you never know until you start doing something and then you learn. Um, yeah, because he's able to. Yeah, that's Zeus. He has broken out of it so many times. He just breaks out of it. And so, I'm gonna have to replace this with something a lot stronger. Yeah. Anyhow, back to the coop. I've never 
<laughs> never built a chicken coop before. She's not actually complete, but she's she's enough to where I'm just gonna leave her for right now. Um, I'll probably be back at my mother's house in about a um, not this weekend, so not Juneteenth, but the weekend after to seal it up to make sure it's watertight and do like the last finish and, to do like the last finish and touches. But I figured I'd let you uh, see what I have done. Remember, like, the thing is, construction isn't hard if you have the correct pieces for the puzzle. Like, when I did the, um, the dog run, I mean, I was working with a lot of two by fours. This is pallet wood trying to use a a diagram or you know instructions for something that you would have the same exact pieces of board for or, or different dimensions it just was not going it was not going the way that it, it wasn't going smoothly so it was a lot of a lot of trial and error but I'll turn it around so you guys can see what's popping so yes hopefully they are able to climb up these steps and do their little chicken thing to go inside that's their roosting pose right here. I still have to put, she's gonna put in um, bedding and everything and I have to put a divider. I have to put a divider in so they have their individual places to be, but the door comes up, comes up like such. Latches, latches shut. And um, <laughs> those two things are, purely because the nails were coming out of the other side. So in order for her not to get punctured, I made sure to, um, this is gonna, I made sure to put something here so she didn't die. Um, this is gonna have netting. Matter of fact, this is, this is gonna, this is gonna be there when I get back. I had to use like, you know, just the stuff that she had around. Around, 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 you know, uh, whew, like the bug. So this, this latches in the back too, like this. So she can take this out and it comes all the way down and she'll be able to retrieve her egg. She can just let it all the way down. Also need to add another hinge. This only has one hinge, I ran out of hinges. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, when I get back, I'm gonna actually move this over here and we add another one over there so it's more secure, but this is, you know, she can get in here, she can clean it out. Um, I'm gonna redo the roof. Obviously the roof is not <laughs> anything. I don't think she's gonna actually bring them out here yet. I mean, she could, they can like be out here during the day, do their old chicken thing. But um, like if it was raining or inclement weather, obviously she'd bring them in the house. But um, <laughs> like, you know, what, you know. So it's this, see, that's the problem. It's these wasps, lord, you see, like, they're just so, they're just everywhere. And so that's why I'm just like, for right now, I just gotta, I just gotta, you know, I just gotta go, I gotta get my, my, my mind right. But anyway, I don't know if I ever showed you the door. So yeah, the door is secure. Oh, wait, I forgot that. This is my little gadget to keep the door open. I think I showed you all this before. Okay. So you have the door. There's some other outdoor. You can see they can get on. And they're doing a little wiki chicken thing. But yeah, down there is going to be another vent. I wanted to make sure they had adequate airflow. But if it turns out that that's too much and like they're getting wet, like so. I'm gonna put something on the inside, some type of plastic something so that water isn't just getting all inside and everything. But I do wanna keep these open for air vents. Heat rises, you want the air coming out of the top. So yeah, there's still work to be done. Still work to be done. But I think they'll like it in here better than the, uh, than the cat cage. <laughs> You know, but they're producing eggs, so I mean, like, they don't seem to be under like um, a huge amount. Yeah, I meant to finish the same thing, but 
they're producing eggs like they produce at least two to three eggs a day they don't seem to be under like immense distress the grass out here literally grows I wish it would focus so you can see oh there we go the grass out here I don't know if you see how tall it is but whew, it literally grows like in a matter of two weeks. Like she's got to get this stuff cut. Definitely bi-weekly. It's hot as a dick. And see, I have on a sweatshirt. I'm about to leave. I got to go home. I'm going back to Atlanta. It's the bugs. The bu <laughs> I need to put my earplugs in because I, I definitely think I have an ingram about stuff fly flying past my ear. Anyhow, family, uh, next time I should probably be on LB, the bus. Some things will be, some things, <laughs> the wall should be up. Let's get the walls up, Mariana. Stop playing. Yeah, but until then, love ya.